Burmese monks gather in front of the United Nations to pray for cyclone victims in Myanmar. As the death toll there mounts, they're calling on the UN Security Council to act. We especially we like to ask, uh, you know, international leaders to not to wait approval from the regime to take immediate action. State television in Myanmar reports more than 43,000 people have died from the storm, an increase of more than 5,000 in just a day, while the UN says more than 100,000 people may have perished. The world body says Myanmar has issued fewer than 90 visas to UN staffers and other international relief workers, but they're being confined to the area around Myanmar's capital, instead of being allowed to go south where the aid is desperately needed. Unless more aid gets into the country... The UN wants to send its top emergency relief coordinator to Myanmar to open it up to more aid. Although he has applied for a visa, he has not yet received it. Meanwhile, Myanmar State Radio is warning legal action will be taken against anyone who hoards or misuses aid, although it's the country's military itself that's suspected of doing that. It denies the allegation. The UN and the Red Cross say perhaps as many as two and a half million people need food, water and shelter urgently, but fewer than 300,000 have been reached so far by aid groups. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.